but it's one of those days where you, you don't want to do it, you don't want to code, it's, but you have to, you can create a million and one reasons why not to show up. You just need that one significant reason to go and just do it. And that one significant reason should outweigh every other excuse that you're making that you do not want to go. I wanted to really challenge myself. That's why I was like, once I started to do jujitsu, I'm like, look, I want to maintain weight training. I still want to hit the gym. I want to become almost like a hybrid where I would see other guys where they would have, you know, they're focused on judo, jujitsu, they lift weights, they're, they're a marksman, you know, they go to the rain. I was like, okay, I want to challenge myself. I want to do, I want to do it all. And because I almost wanted to have like no weaknesses. Like I wanted to be able to like, okay, be, be that hybrid where it's like, no, you can do it all. You, you can be great in, in different things. You don't have to be in a box, you know? So I was like, all right, yeah, we're gonna focus on jujitsu. I'm gonna just have to schedule it, sacrifice some more time. And that's with you guys. You can do whatever it is that you're trying to do or thinking of doing. Once you have that goal, once you have that vision, start almost like planning backwards. It's like, okay, where am I lacking that I'll need to improve on to get better to this goal? You know, it's time, it's the discipline. Usually it's gonna be one of the two. And if you can increase your discipline, you'll, have, you'll find a way to make more time. And that's what I did. One of, something that I was always focusing on is having self-reliance, something that I always tell you guys on these videos, create self-reliance in yourself. You know, no one is coming to save you. I've said that numerous times. I forgot where I heard it from, but you have to almost keep that in mind in a lot of things that you're doing and the decisions that you're making. Like, is this conducive to bettering me? Is this making me a better person with this? I think that's why, I know that's why, one of the things why I started jujitsu was not only, of course, like the physical aspect, yes, that's cool, but I knew this could be a tool that I could develop more discipline, more resilience within myself. You know, I, I, I talk about all these things are tools. All these things are tools to make you a better person. All these things are tools to optimize you. All these things are tools that can push you along to become that better man that you're striving to be. And if you become that better man, then that spills over and you can share that with other people. You know, similar like things that have worked for me, things that have helped me, I come on here and share it with you guys. You know, that's, I think that's one of the missions that that's one of, one of the goals, you know, you, you go through the journey, you learn the lessons, you learn the principles, and then you share it. You know, so hopefully some of you will make some of the same mistakes and waste time like I did, right? But it took me all those things. It took me screwing up. It took me the mess ups. It took me the fuck ups for me then to wake up and be like, okay, let me get it together. And one of the biggest things that I have developed is that reliance, like self-reliance. Like I don't need external validation, external motivation. All I need is inspiration, that internal inspiration. That's how I'm able to get up 330, 245s. Because if I miss it, I don't care about, oh, I could skip a day and this and that. Who cares about that? How does it make me feel? Am I holding myself accountable? You know what's so crazy also, I'm 40 and I've learned so many things and went through so many battles, learned so many lessons within a five year time span that it made up for so much that I did not know, did not learn. Early 30s, 
early 20s, <laughs> late 20s, it's so interesting. You got to go through the journey. And even some of the, the benefits that I've gotten now, if I'd have gotten them early, I wouldn't have been able to keep it. I would have screwed it up. Like, it, 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 wouldn't, it would not have worked. So, a lot. I'm saying that because if you're older, look, I'm 40. If you're older, don't use that number as, okay, a, a meter to say, oh, it's over. I can't bounce back. I can't pick. I, whatever, the current situation that I'm in, I, I'm not able to get out of it. 100% you can because I did it. And if I would have kept that mindset thinking it's too late, the too late mindset, there would have been no channel. You would have, none of, none of the rewards and the fruits of the labor, I would have never have seen it because they came, I mean, late for me, but is it really on my time? Absolutely not. So it's not over. Someone messaged me who's getting ready to start jujitsu. And I'm like, absolutely, you know, should the, it's not even about the question of should you start it's like get started go sign up now